KSBW Weather with Art Jarrett. Well, welcome back. Those temperatures dipped down along the shore. As you can see, temperatures here. Santa Cruz lost about 4 degrees from yesterday. 75 out in Watsonville. Up into the mountains, we still held on to some of that temperature as uh, we only go up a little bit up above that fog layer. And the temperatures were still pretty nice all the way through. 63 in Monterey. Very cool temperatures on the peninsula. To get up to Marina, warmed up a little bit. 67, 66 Seaside. 76 over in Carmel Valley. 69 in Big Sur today. So mild and wonderful temperatures for some folks. Going into the valleys, we popped in. The 80s get into Greenfield, 81 in King City. Pinnacles was around 82 or so. 78 Soledad, 73 in Salinas today. Overnight temperatures were pretty cold last night. 78 Morgan Hill, 82 Gilroy, and 82 in Hollister. So you can see what's been going on. The fog made a big difference for our temperatures today. High pressure is beginning to break down. Low clouds along the shores, and as that happens, we're starting to get a northwesterly feel that's going to happen in later on tonight. And the cool air is going to rush right across northern California and into the Four Corners. As that happens, that cold Old plume is just already making its way down as it will go into Texas, northern Texas, and then reach down all the way into central Texas, cooling temperatures down up to about 18 uh, inches of snowfall for most of the northern tier, all the way down to about 10 inches. You get a little bit further towards Idaho, parts of uh, Washington. Back to the west, here we go. We see that low pressure start starting to work its way across, weakening the ridge of high pressure. There's the northwesterly winds coming in. A little bit of high pressure is going to try to bring itself back for Tuesday and Wednesday. So we bumped up the temperatures a little bit, but that is not going to thwart any chances of rainfall coming in, perhaps for Wednesday overnight into your Thursday morning commute. And that's the way it looks like right now. And perhaps we get into our beach hazards. We're going to see that northwesterly swell. Yeah, a large swell. It's picking up uh, Castroville all the way down to parts of the Big Sur coast. We'll also see it along going north. We're back up to the Golden Gate as well. So we're expanding that. And that has now been in effect since 5 o'clock this evening. And that will continue till Tuesday noon. 60s, 70s, and possible 80s all the way down the four forecast area, 77 Hollister. We're going to see early morning clouds, that fog bank still holding on. 77 in Greenfield, 78 in King City, stretching all the way down into the valley, that fog. 64 in Monterey, 69 in Big Sur, right back up to Santa Cruz. We're going to find ourselves mild temperatures yet again with most overnight temperatures in the 40s. Here's a look, coastal fog moving inland as it's already doing now, and it will be heavy at times, so please be careful. We'll see the overnight temperatures continue on with more clouds moving in by midweek. Rainfall, as I told you, going into the overnight Wednesday and early morning Thursday. 60s and 70s, then we dip it down to possibly even the upper 50s, getting into the mid-70s for everybody, and then that rainfall right there tapering off by the afternoon. Maybe we might pick up about, uh, at least in the mountains, about 0.35 inches of rain. All right, thank okay, you huh? so much. You